reading the Bible, we realize that nothing is in there by chance. Right. Everything is saying something to yes. us. You know, we're talking about the war in Israel and we're talking about how we have to stand wow. up and, and be loud Amen. and be vocal yep. of giving our support to Israel yes. and coming against anti-Semitism yes. that is yes. exploding all mm -hmm. over the world. Mm -hmm. And yeah. understand this is end time prophecy. Right. But you know, just to throw a little thing in before mm -hmm. I talk about Esther yeah. is th th the day that Hamas, these butchers yeah. attacked mm -hmm. Israel and murdered and raped and yeah. beheaded babies, folks, beyond anything, the yeah. evil mm -hmm. beyond anything we can imagine, right. 1400 Innocent people, civilians, taking children and Holocaust survivors and babies into, into captivity and, and many of them that were found murdered. The Torah portion for that day that it happened is in Genesis and it's a, a word to Noah and it says, yeah. in English it says, the world is yeah. filled with violence. Yeah. But if you look at the Hebrew, the word violence is the word Hamas. My That's goodness. what, so when people wow. are sh sh doing demonstrations wow. saying we're for Hamas, yeah. what they're saying for is, what they're saying is we're standing up for violence yeah. against the Jewish people. Listen to me, against the Jewish people. You know, it, it wasn't but a couple months ago that we would say it would never be politically correct yeah to say I'm against the Jew. That's anti-Semitism. Right. But right. we would say, add to that, but being against Israel is the new, new anti-Semitism. Anti yeah.